everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I am so excited. I'm going to the London Horse Show today. I'm taking you guys with me and I am just doing the final touches of my hair and makeup before we leave to go. I am exhausted. I, like you know when you're so tired that your eyes feel really watery and heavy? That is currently how I feel but it's very early in the morning and we have a three to four hour drive um, to get up there so we're leaving nice and early and I'm supposed to be having a meet and greet at three o'clock. I'm extremely nervous and haven't confirmed anything because I am that nervous and I think I'm more nervous that nobody's going to show up so I was offered the live zone at three o'clock today and I didn't confirm that because I did just think if like three people turn up and I'm just sat there in the live zone with all these chairs and three people I just I can't <laughs> the fear so I think I'm I'm heading to the Encora stand for three o'clock um to say hello to everybody but again I haven't confirmed it just in case again nobody turns up so I'm basically what I'm saying once again is if you ever do see me at shows just do come up to me and say hello because I would love to meet you I'm just so scared of t doing like actual official meet and greets where there's like hardly any people that turn up this time next year I might be in a different position hopefully then with a few more followers so I might be a little bit more confident to do it but I just get so scared that no one's going to show so my hair's also looking crazy as I've just taken it out of um, pin curls. I um, air wrapped it this morning and, um, <laughs> and pinned it straight away. <laughs> I've just sprayed it with some Color Wow um, Mystical Shine Spray. I don't like hairspray because it makes my hair feel really like sticky. But I'm actually not going to brush through my hair until I get there just so I know that it gives it a little, just so it has an extra chance of holding today. But it does actually look amazing. It looks so bouncy right now. As well, before I start, the biggest thank you to Holland Cooper for dressing me and styling me for today. I leave all the links to my outfit down below, but I'm in a beautiful black dress of theirs. I'm in black boots of theirs. I've got this handbag. Let me show you this handbag. The only thing is the rest of the day will be on my phone instead of my camera because I don't see my camera fitting inside of this bag, along with all the other amenities that I need to take today. But... How stunning is this handbag so I'm taking this handbag I've also then got a houndstooth scarf to go with this as well and my coat today will be from Zara um but yeah the biggest the biggest thank you ever to Holland Cooper for styling me and dressing me for the day inside my handbag I'm taking with me today I've got plasters in case I get um blisters I'm also going to be taking like little Ugg slippers because if my I'm wearing brand new boots today with heels if my feet end up dying I'm gonna need like Uggs or something comfy to go to continue walking around in I've got some spare tights set tights i've got um a hair comb powder and a brush oh what was in there what did i put in there ah i've taken this which is empty because i'm going to be wearing earrings and when i come home so i'm packing trackies and a hoodie for on, the, for on the drive home but you know when you and also and also makeup remover and moisturizer but sometimes you just want to take your earrings and your jewelry off so i've got that little bag to keep them safe so that's empty i've got some plasters i've got um some spare perfume i've also got blister plasters <laughs> I get such sense. I've got such sensitive feet that literally they only have to touch a shoe and I get a blister. Um, I think I moisturise them too much. I think they're just a little bit too soft. <laughs> um, and what else have I got? I think that's everything inside my bag, other than my phone and my keys. As I say, literally just doing the final touches. I continuously have been spraying this over my face today, as my face has to last for like a whole day. So this is the Charlotte Tilbury setting spray, and I've been drowning my face in that today just again just to hopefully give my skin an extra bit of stick um do i take an eyebrow product i might just take an eyebrow gel in case i need that um am i gonna need anything else i feel like i'm not gonna need anything else like i don't want to go with a load of stuff that i'm not gonna end up using does that make sense i've got a powder i think an eyebrow brush and i think that we should hopefully then do me um spray my hair with some more hair perfume of my actual perfume um this is my favorite perfume of all time it's the invite only from kylie jewelry on scarf on coat on and i'm ready to go and i will see you guys there and i hope you enjoy this video there's a whole coaster as well <laughs> okay guys so we've just got here and the first thing we've done is of course get a you chose me. Oh, God, it's going to be fine. It's not that busy because the afternoon performance is on, I think, so it's quite empty actually at the moment, which is quite nice because we get to walk around all the shops without, um, without whatever I'm on about. I don't know what I'm on about, but yeah. <laughs> Party. 
grandmas and granddads to go, hello buddy! Hello buddy! Hello, buddy. I can hear the hip replacement shattering. Well done! Now all the mums say, hello buddy! Hello buddy! And now we get to my favourite part. All the dads say, hello buddy! Merry Christmas, me. <laughs> well, hello, Dallas. Now Christmas Santa Stakes. Say well done to the mayor! Three through, one for Germany, and two now for Great Britain. It was a big British win earlier on today. Could it be one into this evening as...
Oh no, the last as well. Yes, Crash! No, it's a little different.
a magnificent seven. They're going to come back again to block of the Martin Collins Enterprises Christmas cracker. Absolutely, it looks like this will funnel uh, Lorenzo Luca, John Whitaker, Steve Gunner, Ben Mayer, Mark Setting, and kicking it off. Gold in Tokyo last year with a super horse that's joined his string. Owned by Charlotte Roster and Pam Wright. Exit Remo for Great Britain's Ben Mayer. Good luck, Spock.
Jesus Christ. Christmas Santa Stakes. The crowd will help you though, because he's riding Get Quite America Billy Marmite, a homebred horse for the last to go. Great Britain's Will Fonnell. Congratulations, and uh, Scuderia Ferrari are the uh, prancing horse, and you have the galloping horse. You're always so, so quick. Yeah, she's amazing. Uh, uh, every time she goes in the ring, she really gives her best. And um, yeah, yesterday I had last fence down. She was still uh, the fastest. So today she deserved this win uh, in front of this incredible public. It's always a wonderful atmosphere here. They're running at speed. The dogs never normally have an audience of eight and a half thousand people. They're running in front of maybe two or three. Dog of a lifetime. First up on the line, Rob Hunter, the senior starter, for the Gallop Club. He calls them under line. We're ready to go. Here goes Steph Best, and you've got to cheer. It's Sunday night before Christmas, and away goes Best. Up and over the uh, dog walk, the uh, seesaw. First into the tunnel, now the dog walk. Hits the contact point well, and the other side. Good return there. Very tricky like this, because these are the best dogs in the world. Up and over the apron, down the other side, through the tar. Now, here we go, into the weave. Here comes the sprint time. Here comes the sprint time, 22 seconds there. They're super fast, back into the tunnel. This is brilliant handling. Now we take the turn back. Now we cheer on them. Now we cheer on them. <laughs> 2022, up and over the seesaw, down it goes, into the tunnel we go, back and over, 
up over the dog walk. Craig hits the contact points and Vice is motoring. Vice is really motoring. That was brilliant handling there. Now we got up and over the A-frame through the tyre. Craig calls Vice back. It says weave. Weave away. And Vice is weaving away. Back in. Now we're going to the tunnel. This is super quick. Time to beat is 34.166. And it's game on, London. It's game on. It's game on. It's game on. It's game on. Array of stunts that you definitely shouldn't try at home because the Debris family have set the standard in the modern film world and today are here to show you why they are the world's best stunt team. My lords, ladies and gentlemen, let's rock the building for the Devil's Jackie 
you loving it? It's great fun. <laughs>